Hi gamers, welcome back to another Steam Free to Play walkthrough. Today we have Jump to Die 2 Bloody Soul. Kinda looks like a ripoff of Unholy Heights, but we'll see. Give it a try. Void Demon, the room is the most important way for you and your demon slaves to become stronger. Summoning a room consumes blood, and the more rooms you summon, the more blood you need to consume. Rooms can be upgraded with soul to improve in performance. The rooms are divided into two kinds, demon, a demon enhancer and shrine. Your demons will go to the enhancer themselves to enhance their abilities, and the shrine gives all demons bonus abilities. Of course, you have to build a lounge to give a de your demons a rest. Any room can serve only one demon at a time, and the higher ranked demons will drive away the lower demons to use the room. Arrange them yourself. Yeah, this looks like a ton like Unholy Heights. I don't have any blood, so... I'll void cannon. I'll give you this as a gift. As a humble being, you have a little fighting power of your own, so you need a void cannon. All demons are good at making void cannons. For you, void cannon is your own fighting power. You press the left mouse button to launch it in battle. Every time you make a void cannon, you need your demons to participate. The final result of the void cannon power is related to the strength of all your demons. But beware, every time you call the devil, the cost of building a new void cannon will go up. When, ex when exactly to to build a void cannon, you have to think wisely. Oh, this is beautiful. Void altar. I don't have any demons to use, bro. Consume the collected blood and summon demons at the void altar. Each call increases the cost of the next summoning. Okay. Not only can demons help you fight, they can build void cannons or research black magic for you. Demons are your most important asset, but be aware, there are... They have different elements that affect the room you, they will use. This is where you study and upgrade Blight Magic. Studying the Blight Magic requires your demons to participate, but once the research is successful, you can use the souls to upgrade the magic yourself. Blight Magic is one of the main ways to get stronger. It's time to start attacking. Oh, it's me. What do you want? What kind of portal is this? We're going to attack the Holy Land of Heaven and kill the Saint Lord Reborn. Are you out of your mind? That is the all-powerful God. Exactly who I want to defeat. Okay. Oh, we're not strong enough to kill him yet, apparently. How do I kill these people? What? Summon... Where are my demons at, dog? Void cross will unlock at 100. Time travel will unlock at 25. I guess I have to die to summon things. This one should not escape from its fate. Such behavior cannot be forgiven. I'm going to finish it on my own. Click those running persons to make sure they die. Haha! Ha. <laughs> Why do they just jump to die? These people are satanic believers who are willing to give their souls to the devil. When they jump, you automatically harvest their souls and gain one point of blood. Each dead person can only give you one blood. Only one soul can be provided for the time being. But you have a way to get more souls per person. Can I get more blood? In theory, it's impossible. A human can always provide only one blood. But I've heard that there's a death of artifact that gives more blood, but I haven't seen it. So the question is, what's the use of soul and blood? Listen carefully, rookie. Blood can be used to summon all kinds of things. New rooms, new demons, or new void cannons. And soul can be used to upgrade the room and your black magic. By the way, press the 1, 2, 3, 4 numbers on the spacebar on the keyboard to modify the speed of the game and try it yourself. Get rid of them. Saya! But I don't take damage when they run into me. They just... This is where I win. Apparently. All right, this is where we summon demons, apparently. What kind of demon do we want? Do we want Smasher? Smasher sounds pretty cool. Let's do that. Raise dust demons. These are just buff things. How do I actually summon demons, or do they just come on your own? Code GS. Increase the probability of VIP by 1%. The number of additional souls dropped. What is this, man? 
Why is he flashing like a Super Saiyan? This is a VIP, a very ill person. VIP offer more souls than the usual person. Make sure he is, she is finished here. I can't. Incantation, Akaka, blah, blah, blah. That's become violently, I don't know. So confused. So this is an idle game, apparently, but... Ah, now we have a demon. What's he doing? What's up, homie? Justin Williams. I'm gonna start a holy war. Why not? Why not? You dare? You break into the holy land of heaven? Don't get me wrong, it's not a break-in. Hum, what do you want? This is the first step in destruction. You're fine talking, but I'll have to let tell you to click the left mouse button to launch an attack with your void cannon in case you didn't know. Don't you remind me. Oh, we won! Yeah, baby! Uh, it's kind of like a clan thing and uh... Oh, he's killing my dudes. That's not good. Blend souls, what a harvest. We kind of did good, I guess. Byproduct of ambition. I don't know if you can beat this game. This might be an infinite game. There will be more in the future. You can't win. Level up your rooms and wait for your demons to raise their power. Work harder, my boys. Oh, God. So I can summon... I need... Please. I really don't like that either. That's toxic. War, baby. A humble mortal. What? He said, you're humble. I am. Fuck your mother. Oh, stupid. <laughs> now we're... You went too far, mortal. Ha, I'm just started. Is it? Oh, it's a Pikachu. Oh, final boss coming out early? Have you ever thought about the meaning of the universe? No. No, I'm a free willing person. Free willy. Looks like it is. But you can never touch me. You don't run. The Lord is protected by me and so on. Roll. Y'all are screwed. Here comes your daddy. Oh, I got time pieces. I didn't think you'd be able to get to me, mortal. Did you ever think you were going to die? You're a passerby, I have to say. You are so rude. <laughs> hmm. That's kind of funny. You're screwed, son. We are the chosen ones. Did we kill him? I think we did good work there. I think we can kill tons more. Yeah! Our demons are awesome! I've been waiting for you for a long time, mortal. Wait longer. You actually have a fan? I do! I won't let you wait for nothing. Fall. This is my lord's trial and I will pass it. Dumbass. I keep saying we're gonna see him, but... Oh, he's special because he's too slow. Huh? You're growing too slowly. I'm growing super fast. Huh? <laughs> you can't beat me like this, it's disappointing. What? Maybe you're not the one chosen by fate. What? How long do I have to wait? I don't know, a good amount of time. He gave me this time travel thing. I think he's right, you're growing too slowly. What are you talking about? I've been playing this game for like 20 minutes. I don't talk about problems, talk about solutions. It's time for me to play the my part. Time travel, do I have to pay money for it? Because I'm not doing it. Time travel? Yes, after time travel, you will lose what you have now and maybe even memory, but the experience of your body doesn't go away, and that's called muscle memory. So I'm going to be stronger. Multiply. What are you waiting for? How do I do that? That's the clock like- oh, this is our ascension. In the top upper left corner of your screen, just click that. But what's this if that's my ascension? I don't want to click it. I'm not ready to click it. Are you sure you want to time travel? You're going to lose your blood, souls, rooms, demons, magic levels, void cannon, occupied holy land. Progress will be reset, but you'll elevate levels of your magic as well as time pieces. War! Mess him up! Oh, and we are not str Okay, maybe we do have to time. We just hit our wall. Yeah. Mr. Demon, take me back to the past. Yes, sir! Or what else do I call you for? Hmm. Hmm. Nothing. Okay, so first off, we have to get people to come up to me, and then... War! 
We can win. We just got crit. Can I ask you a question? Yes. Ask. What exactly your home... What exactly your home education is that makes you tw so twisted? Good question. Answering this question will take our relationship to the next level. Yes, that'll decrease my opportunity to encroach on your body. Well, you're a real good devil, but I refuse. <laughs> you're annoyed. Got him. Crit. Crit him. Yes. What level are we? Four. Can I ask you a question? Yes. Ask. Where did you learn your black magic? Library. Nice. Pure self-study player? Yes. Oh my, so genius do exist. That's how the genius do. God dang it. I just don't. <laughs> Can I ask you a question? Sure. Ask. Do you remember what happened before the time travel? What time travel? Oh, never mind. <laughs> Make it clear to me now. Got him. Mess him up, crit him. Can I ask you a question? Yes. Ask. Can you give me your body willingly? No. You're thinking about shit. <laughs> nice. Four. Yeah, take that. As long as I crit, I can kill. It's time to die, mortal. You, this again? I am your father. My lord is my father and I will save you! Well, he surely has lots of fans. Stupid fans. Haha. <laughs> God dang it. What are we on? Floor 50 or something? 44? War! Once that researches, we'll probably do our reset. Oh, hey, Light, have you seen the enemy over there? The Light said I see it, but I won't tell you. Dare you to insult the Holy Light? I even dare to kill it! Nice. Alright, can we do it? Let's see. A little closer, but I don't think we're gonna do it. Ah! Too slow. You're too slow. Shut up. I seem to have heard that. <laughs> You're growing too slowly. What do you mean? I'll shut you up. It's desperate that you can't beat me like that. Fight me. You shut the fuck up. Ah! Hey, what's wrong with you, bro? Ah, my head hurts like shit. Maybe you're not the one chosen by fate. How long do I have to wait? Where are you at? Why do I feel like I've heard these words before? My head is so painful. Ah, ha, ha. Chance, give your body over, stupid man. Don't even think about it. The garbage Holy Lord ran away again. Well, the Holy Lord can't wait any a little long. Can't wait a little longer. I almost made it. <laughs> I'll kill you one day. Oh, come on. You can't kill me. It'll be suicide. What? Now we have this thing, whatever this does. Wait, we're not at 100? I thought we were at 100. What? 98? Well, at least I know we're still getting cutscenes, at least. I thought we might not be because... Um... I was killing the enemy so fast, now you get a cutscene for like 50 floors. So I was quite concerned. Let's give it a try. Yeah, we just beat it. Ooh. I think he's right, you're growing too slowly. Don't talk about problems, talk why do I feel I've had this conversation before? Yes, I did. You don't remember anyway. I won't waver and then there'll be opportunities for you to occupy my body. Give up. Oh, then let's do Void Cross. What is the Void Cross? Even my memory will lose... the... will lose itself in the <laughs> parallel world leap. I'm not sure, but maybe it's related to quantum mechanics anyway. Quantum mechanics anywhere. That's there's a galaxy but like button in the top left of your screen. By the way, I hate Void Cross a lot. What's it do? Are you sure you to Are you sure to do Void Cross? You'll lose everything but void memory and death of artifacts. Then you'll gain void memory times twenty. You'll get a hundred percent times void memory more time pieces after defeating Saint Warriors. I don't wanna lose everything. Like that. Hmm. 
Alright guys, I just left the game playing so I can get my death artifact before I do the void cross. So, let me see. First. Yeah, so basically I would recommend that because you're not, it doesn't seem like you get more blood as you progress. So it's worth getting this eventually. Um, basically max out your suicide capabilities and just let the game run so you can get it. I feel like that's worth doing because double blood, when it's like the only way to prove it's good. Yeah, we're going to do blood. Actually, let's see. Let's do the angel fight one more time just because I have a lot of money. Uh, well, I haven't been moving up my guys, so I don't know if it'll even work anyways. Um, get off me. Oh, it's so annoying. I hate when you zoom in on the characters. Okay. I'm not going to use my money. I'm just going to see how... Oh, my God. <laughs> I'm just going to see how far I can get, if anything. Yeah, we got a few just from sitting there letting my guys level up on the stuff that I hadn't even upgraded yet. Uh, because you do get more void memory if you get farther in the stages, so we're gonna go ahead and do this. Mr. Demon, it's time for you to do Void Cross and conquer the universe. Well, you know that's the thing I hate the most. I don't care about how you feel, I just need you to play the role of Void Crosser. You son of a bitch! <laughs> Alright, we did it. Now we got the Void thing. Which I think means we should do our ascension as soon as we get some time capsules, just because I think, um, what was I going to say? Brain fart. Oh, I need to turn on max speed. Because I get 24 times whatever the time capsule thing I get is, so I need to get those as soon as possible just so I can start grinding them out. And the more I get of those, the faster... I'll be able to upgrade my thing so I can get more of that. But the bad part is, is I actually have to research now, which is lame. That's another reason why it might be better to do your time pieces as soon as possible. Just so you can get your research out of the way and it'll just make it more expeditious. Alright guys, I was letting the game run while I got some stuff done. I was trying to collect the 100,000 blood, but as you can see, I'm a good bit over that. Um, so now we're going to get the last thing here, the non-existent god. Ugh. Let's see what it does. Ramen. Alright, we got it. I don't know what it does, though. No, no, no. My bad. Yeah. I wonder if I summon something with that, or what What does it do? Not sure. Oh, yeah. We gotta try to see how far we can get now that I've been sitting here. Whoa, whoa. Wah, wah, wah. Jacking them up, son. Wonder how far this game actually goes. Cause we're at 178. All right, I guess we reset here. I still don't know what this does, though. Hopefully, I figure it out eventually. We'll get 100... Yeah. Alright. Mr. Dima, it's time for you to do the Void Cross and conquer the universe. Well, you know that's the thing I hate the most. I don't care about you, Phil. I just need you to play the role of Void Crosser. You son of a bitch. Again. Alright. Alright, guys. I got some more tips while I'm trying to figure out this game and get to the end of it. Um, one, the white things, anybody can use them, which makes it so much better than anything else. Also, if you level the white things, you don't have to spend as much time leveling everything else up. Like, you can just go from straight spell to spell all the way to the end where you want to get your Lord of Void. You just get the white pieces. I've also learned, um, I, when I unlocked the non-existent god, Ramen, I figured out that what it does, I believe... It uh, makes your Void Cannon crit 100% of the time, which is good. Um, and I think that's an integral part to getting to your late game. So what I've been trying to do now is, to get to the end game, is use this Void Gunnery, which puts my Demon Strength on my Gunner. Um, I also use these to make my uh, Demon stronger. I don't, I can't really tell you that, I try to keep everything semi-even-ish. Some things are more expensive than others, like this for instance. Um, and of course you want to level this, you need to level this. Um, there's three things that give you souls in this game. Your Koji Ash, your Unlimited Moon Blood, 
this and your wave at your holy gate. This kind of peters off, but you need to do it as well. It does boost. Um, what I'd recommend if you're trying to level that is just whenever you notice that you're kind of hitting a plateau and it's not like boosting your souls like it should when you're in your moon phase, start leveling the other things. Try to keep them even. That's usually what I do. I try to level things in tens because the eleventh thing usually jumps your soul cost. It makes it like that much more expensive. Um, but that's basically it. Also, when you um, upgrade your cannon, like you see how it's 27, 3, 4, 7, 8. Until I upgrade it, it won't get the buffs from my guys like strengthening themselves. Um, so you really, I, I only have like three or four demons right now. And I'm keeping it down just to three things because they can all use it. Um, because you need your blood to actually level this up. Granted, I'm saving a ton of blood right now, but... Yeah, let's see how far we can get. Also, um, I found out to scale, you kind of have to keep doing war over and over again because take, like the enemy starts doing so much damage, you just kind of try to burst them. So watch. Um, and I excuse me for the loud clicking because I'm gonna be trying to because I'm using the cannon now. So you gotta click a lot. But see how it killed me so fast? But I killed so many of them, so I went up like 11 levels there, and you just keep doing it. You gotta go like glass cannon because you're not gonna out survive them. I figured out. Which is kind of lame, because I really wanted to do a demon build, but my arm gets tired too. But yeah, so that's a plateau, so now I have to strengthen up again, but um, yeah, so basically you just want to keep boosting your souls with your two, three main things, and then you want to start leveling these up as well, and I try to keep everything about even so I can keep it just... It looks better to me, and I like it a lot better. But that's all the stuff I figured out so far. Uh, if I figure out anything else, I'll include it as well. But basically, our goal is just to beat this game at the moment, and I'll just keep figuring stuff out as we go, and I'll keep updating you guys in the video. The journey continues. The legend will never die. Yeah. I gotta upgrade my cannon. And I was like, whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa. Where's my damage? <laughs> Took a nap. Hopefully, I grinded enough that I can get a good bit further. With my guys trading for about three or four hours. I'll get that much farther to be honest with you. Probably won't get past 425. Scaling just sucks so bad at this point of the game. Bleeding penis cannon.
That's 425. I guess I'll have to send and try again. Lord almighty. I'm actually going to call it quits here after playing this game for about... I played it for about... 14, 15 hours. The problem is with this game... And why you can't get too far into it... Is that this is your highest like unlock that's going to boost you. I even unlocked all these things by saving up my blood to get them. Uh, this gives you 100% crit on your cannon, but it's just not enough. And the reason why is because the way the creator has it right now is that when you level these things up, when you hit a 10 interval, the timepiece cost is way too much. Even when you, you transcend with the last upgrade, you don't get that many more soul or timepieces than you do originally. You get a good bit more, but not enough to keep up with the scaling that it costs on this. Um, I don't think this game's really made to go past a certain point. I really think the 100 times scaling thing isn't enough for how this ramps up every 10 places. Overall though, it's a pretty good game if you want to waste some time, but it's just not feasible to get to like end game. It doesn't feel, it felt super good and rewarding at the start, don't get me wrong. But once you get past the 100 mark and you have all these things, you just plateau so hard. Um, every time I transcend, I might get maybe 10 more floors out of it. Maybe 20. Um, if I, like, sit there and let it, like, grind itself. It's just not worth the time. But I gave it a pretty good attempt. I gave it about a good solid of, like, 15 hours of solid play. Um, until I was just like, eh. Just not enough. Not enough return on it. But... Yeah, I mean, I think I came up with a good strategy. If you do want to advance the game, I pretty much know exactly how the game works. It's actually a little bit complex. Well, it's not complex. There's just little stuff you can miss, like with the white shrines, we're upgrading all the demons. Um, how to upgrade your currency. Also, this plateau is so hard, too, because these don't get better as you go on. Like, they're going to cost the same amount of souls and give you the same upgrade. Also, if this actually worked correctly, where your probability went up by 1%, and you could get it to 100%, then that might change some things, but it definitely does not. I've had this thing all the way to, like, level 200 and something, and get, like, maybe 4 or 5 VIP souls, like, every 2 minutes at 4 times multiplier speed. Um... But I'm still going to release this video because I spent so much time on it. If you want to try the game out, see how far you can get, um, be my guest. Maybe later, uh, if I leave this game going enough, I can get to like floor 500. But 1,000 is going to be too hard. And I haven't got a cutscene since like floor 100 and something. Since floor 100. I have not gotten a cutscene in this game since floor 100. Um, the highest floor I got to was 425. 424. But... Oh my god. Yeah, I might release some video at a later date where I get to like the final boss. I don't know if the final boss is even in the game. I would assume he'd be at either floor 500 or 1000. But if he's at floor 1000, there's... I can't see myself getting to him to be honest with you. I just can't... Uh, I just can't play this game when the return is so low. Because I just spent my time pieces after grinding to 424. And I could barely level anything up. And I just realized that's just not worth it. Like, uh, I leveled this up maybe three times. I leveled this up once. And look how many pieces I need. 11 million. That would be my whole run worth of time pieces. 11. I even tried to abuse the cannon even though I really didn't want to because of the, uh, the thing we unlocked here that gave you 100% crit. But that's not even that good. It's high. But it's not that great. Um... Blindness. And this, this doesn't scale that good. Like, it just doesn't. Just a... uh, Alright, guys. Well, thanks for watching as always. If you like videos like these, please like and subscribe. I'm going to edit all these parts together. Because I would just, like, play the game, take apart, play the game, take apart. But it was a struggle. God dang.